No love that show up, but Mr. Chuck New recruiter try if he broke him not Can't get squawk so him gets the shot and Bust him wing by and cut out him back Me tired and me fed up by it Too much violence in the place It's like, yo Showtime and some, you know, they might come body you up and they might come use them big top law. You have to come scrape a weed. It's supposed to it's get. It's not a scrape. See, that's mentality though, and that's what needs to change. Yeah. Welcome to Live Foot TV and the right place. So let's go, don't go nowhere. Please like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell. Bless your love and greetings, my viewers and subscribers, kings and queens, line and line, and speak about yourself. Welcome to Lion Foot TV, and what man of peace. I always say give thanks to everyone and strength. Give thanks to another day, and I mean, give thanks to the going out and the coming in. Holy man, you realize, see. Yes, man, if you're new to the platform, please consider to like, share, subscribe, and click the bell. And I mean, yeah, man. So, in this episode, yeah, you know, it's a sad full one. I want to send out R.I.P. to the families and friends of the footballer, Rafik Thomas, who was, um, you don't know, taking out gun down in his sleep. I want part of them down there. I don't know him personally, but you don't know me at the man of peace. And, you know, we are singing we are sing songs, we're crying for peace, and we're tired, and fed up by it, and violence. And, yeah, I just treat positivity across the board. So, who not update on that? And, and it's so sad to see him that. Uh, I cry, you know. I say she want her father, John Oster. I don't wish that for no one, my worst enemy. A life, love, to say. As I mean, I say, long life and prosperity. Yeah, man. And also, we have a vlog with um, got a little snippet from, you know, Skeng manager, Skeng uh, Roger Wilde, and, you know, the young artist, and we are going with them thing right, you know, mm, Kara. Is it me? Um, yeah. Somebody who I know personally still from the UK. And we just child. Never know Sasha I'm on the skank them until I was the interview with Jeffrey. Big up Jeffrey. Uh, doing things here. We're not yelling king. You see me so I pick up one part of the reasoning still about management and honesty and trust and them thing there. And you see me? Unity and share the food in the music industry. Producers, artists. Yeah man, give unto Caesar what is drawn to Caesar. So I say, yeah, so I don't know. We're gonna kick off the show on about I don't know my people, please go and check out my EP, Welcome to Kingston. I the song, Tired and Fed Up It. You see me and say, yeah man, it depends on the EP, Welcome to Kingston. Crying for peace. Is it? Yes, my viewers and subscribers. So don't go away to my kings and queen. Yeah man. I watch them on the German represent for Lion Foot TV. Yeah, RNG. Tell them on the strongest soldiers, get the hardest fight. Lion Foot, Patriots, out oh, there. Don't stop trying. Yes, Rafiq Thomas, footballer, was taken out in his sleep at his home, then I'm town, you know what I mean? Yeah. You see me, um, in the early hours of 4.30 a.m. I'm seeing another article, and you know, we're seeing that I cry and people that cry. Star. Cha -cha. I don't know him personally, but I know me had a man of peace, and I wish death upon no one. We just want to see peace and love in my fellow country, Jamaica, you see me? So this is where the article states. A popular footballer was shot dead and another Man injured when the gunman invaded her home on Water Street in Denham Town, West Kingston, Tuesday morning. The dead man has been identified as Farmer Boys Town player, 40 year old Rafiq Thomas. The injured man has been hospitalized. So that happened this morning, you know, man. You see it, and you know, Farmer Boys Town player. See, I don't know if he mix up in nothing or. And the next man them go for, me don't know. As me say, I don't know them, but I know me had a man of peace and I'm crying for peace. You see me? So, I don't know Rafik Thomas played for several teams and these are the teams he played for. Rafik Thomas scored the winning goal that helped Boys Town win the championship league last season in the final against Kansan Spring. He has also played for several local clubs including Waterhouse, Arborview, Tivoli Gardens and Umbre Lions. So you so much team he played for. So like a good footballer still. You see me? And I scored a winning goal last season to help his team win the champions championship league, you know? Judge Star. My condolences to the family again. So um watch this little clip and you know, 
we could see the journal star sir John was I mean, I like just hearing the, the, the young lady at Christ say she want her father, you know? She want her father, them kill him, them sleep. It's hurting, man. Hurtful. I mean, I don't know them personally, but I feel it, you know? Because I know me had a man of peace, and John was there. The baller, you know? I don't know if the baller mix up in a nothing, but why would they go for him, you know what I mean? Something into something, but I don't know, I don't want to do nothing. No, me no one know, you see me? But me know say my condolence to the families them. You see it and it's sad to see a footballer where it look like he's a good footballer with talent, you know, has been taken out. You see me? Again, you have to be careful who you associate, associate with what you say around people. You know what I mean? You know, line of foot now swear for no one. But just I say my condolence. You know, you also hear someone said, oh, what's a big shot all name chest? So you know say I got the rifle or pump here, something, you know what I mean? Powerful was used on him. But the next person is in hospital, he survived the attack. So, ah uh, boy. Let me view us and subscribe as big up on the self, you know. Anyway, um, it's sad, man. <laughs> yes, yeah, so moving on now, as promised, um, we're gonna break down this little interview, yeah. Looks like a little piece. You know, from Kara speaking to Jeffrey about music industry and producers and artists and should have the understanding and be respectable and share the food and be honest. You know, honest is the best policy. That's what my mother taught me as a youth growing up. And that's still instilling me, you know. Yeah, man. So, we're going to break it down and we're going to hear a share and we're going to chip in and talk. Soon. And this is for every young artist and young producers and big producers too and big artists too because I don't know. No man, no bad and better than no man, you know. Equality and share the food, is it? Yeah, man. It's like, yo, showtime and some, you know, they might come bad with you up and they might come use them big top law, you have to come scrape a weed, they supposed to It's get. not a scrape. See, that's mentality, though, and that's what needs to change. Yes, man. So this lady goes by the name of Kara and her company is called Showtime Services by Instagram. You can go check her out. So basically, um, Jeffrey is asking her um, if she bully producers them like oh she have a top lawyer them and represent the artist them and etc but she had answer still you see me but it's a little piece of the interview we take it from the one go watch the full interview just go over jeffrey um interview is very interesting if you want to know more about um showtime services is it because everybody is due something yeah i forget to caesar we're due to caesar uh, one man can't get everything yeah so basically what she's saying you know, everybody is due something the artist the producer the songwriter Anybody involved in making the product the material, you know, they do their duly rights where they need to get them percentage. But you know, some producers, them could be an artist back and say, them help write the song when they never and claim most most percentage of the product. And this will cause the bangarang and the confusion and the breakdown of the relationship. Uh, there's it? no complete song without lyrics. A composition is a composition. The minute there are lyrics and a voice on, on it, it becomes a song. It's not a song without those three components, right? Uh -huh. But those three components might come from three different people. There's the writer, there's the voice, and there's the composer. There she said it again, give unto Caesar what is due to Caesar. You know, sometimes you hear a song, it's not necessarily the artist write the song, you know. I can a different writer write the song and give to the producer or give to the artist. You have agency looking for songwriters for artists to sing. So sometimes three different people play a role in our song. Then there's mechanical, there's songwriting. You understand? There's lots of moving parts to music. Yes, man, and for those who don't know, your mechanical rights is when your song plays on the air or, you know, your live performance or... You know, some band play your, your rhythm or your, your song or anywhere at all. That's a mechanical rights. You see me? I say so. Make sure you register up. Yes, PR is a BMI. You see me? Me have a little knowledge about the business, you know, but I still have learn. Maybe that's why they don't want to work with me. And the minute people start to accept and own what is theirs and stand for what is theirs and not somebody else's, the better things will be. Uh -huh. well, I, mean, I, like, I love how Cara deal with it. Very professional, you know? Stand up for your rights and what you own. You know what I mean? That's why you're good for register up and learn the business and read as an upcoming artist. 
I see me over deck two decades of me a trying the business. I'm learning and been around a lot of people and learn and observe and understand the business a little bit. You know, I don't know. We pay, we pay our rest up, we publishing up. We just need to get the break now and start making some money out of the music. Yeah, and can give back, you know what I mean? To charity and to the family and help some people to use it. Yeah, you know, but I just say I think them my viewers and subscribers. Um yeah man, make sure you think them registered up and you know the producer them have to just be honest and the artist them have to be honest as well. If you say 50 50, a 50 50 or 60 40, 70 30, whatever, who play them part in the creation of the song, the product, material, make sure everybody get them diligence. You see me I say them due diligence. Yes, man, I just say I think them man. Honesty is the best policy. So big up yourself, Jeffrey. As myself, if you want to listen to the full interview, go over Jeffrey page, go watch the full interview. You see me, big up Kara um show time services i don't know people please remember to go and check out my ep welcome to kingston i am an independent artist doing it on my own and you know when i stop trying you see me until we get a bligh big up on yourself and man of peace blessed love yeah man rest of inspiration coming from i and i i am eric you know